It's Riff Arcade! I'm Josh, he's Butts, and today is a very special day here on Riff Arcade. It is the one year anniversary to the day that we started this channel with a Donkey Kong Country video. So, we thought it would only be appropriate that we start year two with some Donkey Kong Country 2 Diddy's Kong Quest. Not Diddy Kong's Quest, which is what a lot of people think. Uh, but today, we're going to do something a little different. Uh, we're going to play not only Donkey Kong Country 2, but today we are going to play Donkey Kong Country 2 Golf. That's right. <laughs> We've made some house rules to make the game a little more interesting. So, um, I'll talk about that. Uh, let me dive right in. Um, I've got a save prepared for us. Fresh out of the oven. Let's go ahead. Oh, still hot. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you put your saves in the oven? Okay. I do, I do. It, it keeps them nice and fresh. I and, air uh, fry them, but that's just me. <laughs> oh, that's healthier, makes I some, guess. Makes them crispy, yeah. <laughs> Less fat in those saves. Yeah. But, uh, so, uh, you folks out there are probably asking yourself, what is Donkey Kong Country 2 Golf? And then saying to yourself, we didn't ask that, stop putting words in our mouth, Josh. <laughs> to which I say, <laughs> uh, I'll tell you exactly what Donkey Kong Country 2 Golf is. Um, the rules are very simple. Uh, the general idea of Donkey Kong Country 2 Golf is that bananas add to your score, and in golf, the higher your score is, the worse you're doing. So, <laughs> if you get to the end of the course with zero bananas, great job, you've done amazing. So. As you'll see, this actually works out really well because the level design gets really interesting once you stop allowing yourself to touch bananas. So, you can't touch bananas. Bananas are off. Um, and if you do, they add to your score. Uh, secondly, uh, each level is a hole and each area is a course. So, Pirate Panic is the first hole of Gangplank Galleon, which is the course. Um, Butts and I will take turns. I'll go first, uh, since I know the level's better, then Butts can see where the bonus areas are, and uh, then he can do them after I do. Uh, lives subtract from your score. So if you finish a level with zero bananas and five lives, you have a score of negative five, which works out because that's the score you'd actually see in real life golf. And then uh, lastly, the stars and bonus levels don't count. So that's still your incentive to go get the bonus levels um, and get extra lives to decrease your score. So without further ado, let's dive in. Uh, and all these... <laughs> All these were made up several years ago. Just me and my cousin were really bored, so we just made them up on the fly. So these are all amendable if Butts and I discover that some things aren't quite working out. But <laughs> yeah. Okay. Decided, eh, Diddy Kong's not hard enough. Let's make it harder. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so that's alive. I've added life to my score and therefore a negative one to my overall points. Uh, these bananas the are bad. I don't want the bananas. So I jump over them and we move on i feel the need to tell the riffers that you should not avoid bananas in real life they're rich in potassium and other nutrients that they're just darn tasty so avoid them in the game not real life excellent uh good good health tip michael butts <laughs> <laughs> yeah let no one say we don't look it up for you <clears throat> and so the four letters of kong are useful and that they can give you a life uh, and subtract a point from your score, but keep in mind that even a single banana overrides that. So, it's a little risky, so I'm gonna skip Kong for this level and move on. Ah! Here, Josh, we're playing it safe and going through the fairway. I'm not gonna go, not gonna go over the trees, as it were. <laughs> he switched to his two iron. This is a, a very conservative move, but, but very well thought out. Okay. Approach. Oh, excellent. Good. That was a good lie on that one. Oh, nice throw the monkey. That's good. Yep, yep, throw the monkey. You folks at home, golf clap whenever Butts and I do <laughs> anything <Yeah>. good. <laughs> ah. There's the, the barrel hazard there. 
<laughs> the barrel hazard. Okay. Now, Rambo, uh, oh, he decided to go with the rhino. That is a very... I guess making up for that conservatism earlier by taking a no. risk is a very risky move. I don't like it. I don't like it. Also, Sorry, Rambi. Nope. 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 <laughs> and he has thrown his club across. <laughs> Banned the club in the water. Thrown my club into the lake. <laughs> okay. And see, Rambi could have gotten me into a bonus level, but I didn't want to risk it. Okay. So have to climb the barrels, go over the bananas. Using a wedge there. Yeah. <laughs> Open face club, a sand wedge. Yes. Club sand wedge. Very nice. <laughs> Avoid the That was good. That was a good bit of avoidance. Thank you. Okay, so once again, a choice. See, I could try to jump from the barrel and grab a life, but it would be far too expensive in bananas to do so. So I'm just going to give the exit a little love tap. Boop. The tap room. Oh, and it's in. Very nice. Very nice. And move on. Bring it as putter monkey. Very good. Oh, and it seems a <laughs> member of the spectator has made contact with the putter monkey, and yep, he's into the stands and tearing her throat out. Oh, it's. Well, there are signs about this. We really should warn people about that, but. <laughs> uh, we, will, we will move on to our next, next event. Okay, so to get my score, let me get my little uh, golf pencil out golf pencil here <laughs> write down my score I have zero bananas and five lives so Josh comes out of this hole with a negative five uh, we're gonna go now to butts at the tee off position uh, over in the tee box uh, take it away butts ladies and gentlemen we have joined Michael butts here at the tee box of hole one uh, butts will now take his swing let's see what happens <laughs> and the monkey's off. <laughs> I'll see you Excellent. in the parking lot. <laughs> All right. So, uh, Donkey Kong Country 2 Golf was actually invented by me and my cousin Spence, who's joined us on a few Final Fantasy XIV streams. Uh, so if that name sounds familiar, it's that guy. It's, it's him. Uh, yeah, we were just bored one summer. I think it was like maybe between college years or something. We did this years ago, and I like I just remembered it the other day, and I was like, but we should do Donkey Kong Country 2 Golf! To which he said, what is that? Anyway, uh, moving on. <laughs> so that's when Spence and I just sat down, we sat in our room playing Donkey Kong Country 2, and just coming up with a way to make the game more interesting. Ooh, Butts is going for Kong. <laughs> oh, I am. Butts is playing to win. Fast and loose. That's how I play <laughs> golf. No, it's going to be really hard is like in the middle of this when you're not thinking straight and you just like unintentionally just run into bananas thinking like, yeah. oh, hey, bananas. <laughs> <laughs> No, <laughs> yeah. Because Spence and I did that too. Like we'd just be doing Donkey Kong Country Two Golf, and then oh, oh no, oh. <laughs> no. We'll go to the. Uh, we'll kill that thing. You might be able to do a bonus level now or something. Oh yes, that was a bad. And kind of try to balance it out. Yeah, run to the left or to the right. Okay, there's nothing to the left. Try the right. Yeah. Okay. So you might be able to turn this around. Whew. Bad chip shot. Maybe. <laughs> oh, don't get those. Well, never mind. Hmm. Oh, we can get oh, a banana my. coin. Which, as of yet, has no, no effect on your score, but... I don't know, maybe we'll amend one later, so... Okay, so it didn't pan out. If it had been a collect the stars, it would have been yeah. better, but... Oh, well. <laughs> um, <laughs> <laughs> Bad shot. Oof, yeah. Right into the bunker. Yeah. Oh, you hate to see that. Got himself into a mess here. How can he get himself out? And Dixie can float, if you remember, if you hold down the Y button. Yes. Okay. Very good. Oh. Making up for that last shot. <laughs> up and over. Uh oh. oh. <laughs> 
And so this is where, see, like, we could even do a handicap if if that's where, like, this. Consider this a test run. <laughs> After this right hole, now. we'll we'll see where we end up. Oh, 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 <laughs> oh. Oh, there oh, you go. There we go. Now. <laughs> Tiny hot. Oh. <laughs> oh I should have waited bananas. for an extra person, yeah. <laughs> All right, so go back into um, the first level again and pause the game immediately, and we will take your score. Uh, seven and six. Okay, so Butts has seven bananas. And six lives, which means he comes out with a score of one. One stroke. Mm. One All day. right. Good in potassium. Bad for Donkey Kong Country 2 Golf. <laughs> well, so that's it. That is our premiere episode of year two of Riff Arcade with some Donkey Kong Country Golf. Uh, we're going to do the full course of Gangplank Galleon here. Uh, so stick around and we will see you folks right here on the next episode of Riff Arcade. If you like Donkey Kong Country 2 Golf, throw a like down there. Uh, give us a share. Tell your friends about it. Let's get going strong for year two. Bye-bye. Yep. <laughs> Keyboards go.